We need to like, you need to come closer. <laughs> You're so tall and I'm so small. <laughs> Hi guys, I'm Monica and welcome back to my channel, Money Reads, where I talk about books and things. And this is my husband, Rodrigo. Say hi. Hi. Rodrigo's really nervous because English is his second language and he's still learning. So he's really nervous, but we thought this would be a really fun idea. Books and Lala and I'm guessing a bunch of other people have done something like this where their husband actually chooses their TBR. And I think this will be particularly interesting because my TBR, I would say, is 95% in English. Yeah. Or no, more. more or less. <laughs> yeah. O only, only my books is in Spanish, I think. Yeah. No, I have some Spanish books in, in my Kindle. Yeah. <laughs> I chose for you. Yeah. <laughs> he chooses for me. So I thought it'd be really cool for Rodrigo to choose my, not April, my May TBR. And what I'm going to do is I'm very, very much going to put these on and Rodrigo is going to drop the books into this box, right? He's going to put the books in there and if he picks a Kindle book, we just have a piece of paper where he's going to write the name of the book and then um, we're going to get my reactions to the 10 books that he chooses. Now, if you guys remember, I did a video about my TBR takedown, which means that if he doesn't choose a book that fits into that TBR takedown, I still have some leeway to choose um, some of those books. I did tell him that he has to choose one of the books from over here, which is my red shelf and my new shelf. You guys see my new shelf and Chulu's down here just chilling. <laughs> so uh, without further ado, let's get right into the video. I'm gonna put these on and what all you're gonna see is me listening to him rummaging through my books which is now like the skit i thought i was gonna be okay with it but i'm actually really scared yeah yeah <laughs> are you scared yes oh and then i'm gonna ask him why he chose the books that he chose so he, he also has some english um to explain some english to use and i'm really excited because i love it when he speaks english so all right let's get started i'm gonna put this on this video is suddenly gonna start looking a little kinkier than it is okay Go! Pick 10 books for me. Here's my Kindle. Okay, a kiss. <laughs> I can't see you. Here, here, my Kindle in case you need it. Wait, wait. Okay, I'm gonna, I'm gonna just chill. I'm gonna move over here. I don't know if I, you can see me. I, what? I will choose the, the 10 books and then I show to the camera. No, exactly. Oh yeah, he's gonna show you the books after he chooses them. So you guys will get to see them before I see them. Oh god. Mm -hmm. I'm so nervous. <laughs> Ooh, I like it. I am, I'm already one like 100% sure he's gonna choose one book because I know he wants me to read it so I, I am like waiting for it. I have five. All right are you gonna choose any from my Kindle? Yes. Okay. I need one more. One big one. What do you mean one big one? <laughs> 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 I will kill you if you choose Memorias de Dune. I'm not reading no, that no, book no. again, okay? I'm so nervous. If you, oh, I have also read this. I think these. that this one is good now. Okay? Yes. Okay. Are you finished? Yes. All right, show the books that you chose for okay. the camera. I, I I'm going to move I'm going to move from here so that you have space. I I chose. Um this one. Okay, don't tell them why. Just mm -hmm. Okay. And this you can see a uh, name. Okay. I can't even okay. tell. Uh, the name of the um, of the books of the in the Kindle. Don't say them. Just no. Then and at the at the I'll I'll, at the, I'll yeah okay. I I chose three from Kindle. Oh good. Yeah. All right. Cool. Yes. All right. So are we ready? Wait. Two more. <laughs> and this one. Yeah, I finished. Okay, okay, I'm gonna take these off. Cover, okay. can you cover or I can, put? I can put in, 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 in the middle. Okay. Oh, yeah. <laughs> All right, let me see. Can yeah, I? No, wait, wait. Okay, I, oh, you passed me. Okay, okay, but let me get in the frame. I'm, okay. And you, you, you try to. Um, Guess why? Yes. Okay. All right. Okay, so charm, charmed life. Mm -hmm. I 
Did you choose it because the cover is pretty? Yeah. <laughs> I, I like. <laughs> my, my favorite color is, is green, but this this blue, I think, is so beautiful. Yeah, this is such a pretty cover. Yeah, and I have a dragon. Yeah. I, mean, ha I like dragon. <laughs> and it's green. <laughs> I love you so much. <laughs> I guess one of the books I'm reading for this month is Charmed Life by Diana Wynne Jones. All right, next, next, next. <gasps> so the next book he chose is The Monsters We Deserve by Margaret Sedgwick, um, which I have been wanting. Did you choose this because you know I want to read it? Yeah, I, I see when you open the the box yeah oh thank you oh my god i'm sorry we're gonna just keep being cute oh, wait, and keep hey, stop. Mm -hmm. this one. <gasps> oh, okay dragon's code by and uh by my giggy mccaffrey uh dragon writers of pern um why did you choose did you choose this one because it has a dragon in it? i know <laughs> we we chose in uh, fnac yeah, FNAC is a the store last, here. The, the last time we go to FNAC together. Exactly. Okay, so that's cool. All right. Uh, I'm not giving any synopsis of these books because <laughs> um, actually uh, you've seen most of these. So, mm -hmm. all right, next. Oh, cool. The Sign of Four by Arthur Conan Doyle. Did you choose this because of the cover? No, okay. because it's small and I like tigers. And <laughs> Do, do you know what this book is about? No. This is a this is a story of Sherlock Holmes. Oh, I like it. Yeah, so that's pretty cool. Mm -hmm. <laughs> All right, next. Mm -hmm. Oh wow! A darker shade of magic by B. E. Schwab. Mm -hmm. B. E. Schwab wrote one of my favorite books of all time. Mm -hmm. I don't know if you know that. I I I like the the clothes. You like the clothes. I imagine uh, a coat. Coat. Yes. yes. Okay, cool. So, um, for those of you that don't know, this is Darker Shade of Magic by B. E. Schwab. It's a book about magic and people that can walk through different Londons. And uh, B. E. Schwab wrote Vicious, which is actually the book that got me back into reading. So, very excited to yeah. read this. Okay. All right, next. This other one. I knew it. Because this, this we, need, we need one one book in Spanish. <laughs> and also, this is the one that I knew he was going to pick for me yeah. because he really wants me to continue on with the Dune series. And I'm a Dune fangirl, so thank you. I'm I'm actually I was hoping that you would pick this one. And it's short. Thank you for picking yeah, short books. I think that two or three shorts and then yeah. the other medium. Yeah, and then Oh, you want me to read? Yeah, I think that when when you when you uh, read at the last time, mm -hmm. uh, it's not a good moment for you. I was having now, a bad moment, yeah. But I uh, have you. But, yeah. Uh, and now I think that it's new form, new style to read. Yeah, it's like a new mindset. Yeah. Yeah. Oh my God, I would never imagine you choose this. Thank you. I'm so excited. Yay! All right. And now the three. Uh, uh, books Kindle books. Kindle. All right, so we have. Okay. Okay. I'll read for you. Okay. I think that. You have to be in the camera. <laughs> uh, Martha Wells. Okay. Uh, All systems read by Martha Wells. I'll put the like. I'll put it here for you guys. Mm -hmm. I'm really excited to read this one. Thank you. That's in my a... face. Put it in my face. I, I'll put it over your face. <laughs> it's a science fiction book, and yeah, yeah. I, I think that I chose only one. Uh, uh, science fiction book. Yeah, which is and Dune. I so another one. one is another one. Cool, I like it. All okay. right. The Empire of Sand. You oh. chose Empire of Sand. Yeah. Why? I don't know. I like the name. Uh, the at the end. I Empire guess. of Sand by yeah, yeah. Tasha Suri, which I bought because another person in BookTube recommended, oh, okay. and I have no idea what it's about. Oh, uh, <laughs> I, I see the name. I say sounds well. Sounds fun. Mm -hmm. All right, cool. Uh, and uh, I don't know how I read. Like normal, with, without ah, the with, uh, with fire. Really? Yes. I am so surprised. Why did you Why did you choose which fire? Two By <laughs> easy. <laughs> he, he does, he I don't know uh, how the book is about. I, no, I don't read nothing. I see just the, saw two dragons. The face of the book. <laughs> 
<laughs> the cover. The yeah, I know, I know. But this is the face because <laughs> it's, it's a dragon. It's a dragon. I mean, you see the face. There is a face. I. Yeah, I in the wind. Yeah. Um, Upon the. For anybody that saw my Kindle haul, I will explain to you. Mm -hmm. The reason I have this book is because in high school, mm -hmm. one of the girl, somebody who was a very good friend of mine, loved this book and she was like so passionate about it and she told me, you have to read it and she let me borrow her copy and I read it like the first two pages and I was like, oh, I don't care about this book and I lost her favorite book. So I feel so guilty and now I'm going to finally read it. <laughs> okay, look at this. <laughs> wait, wait, wait. Oh, oh no. Our cat was in the box. Mm. Okay, so out of out of all the 10 books that you chose, the what is it? The six physical books and the six six seven uh, my maths. Math and me. So the seven physical books and the three Kindle books. You did choose a reread, so that's good. You chose the continuation of a series, so that ticks off some of the. Uh, three dragons. Yeah, you chose a bunch of dragons. I think the sign of four by author uh, by author Conan Doyle counts as a classic, so I'm gonna count this for my classics. So you chose three of the four books of the six books. Sorry, three of the six books that I kind of have to read. All right. So I have to. You have to choose three more. Me. It, well, no, I'm gonna, no, you, you're, you're done, you're finished. But I have to choose three more books for my May TBR. A long book, a comic book, oh, and of course, my non-fiction read. So, I already know the non-fiction read. I'm so glad he didn't choose one because I would have still chosen. All right, so, after some deliberation, I have... <laughs> <laughs> I'm so big. <laughs> I know. I never. We always joke that he's like so, so big compared to me because I'm actually really small. But anyway, after some deliberation, I have chosen the three extra books that I'm going to read this month. And like I said, I'm glad he didn't pick a nonfiction because I really want to read Tudors. Uh, yeah. with, by The Family Story by Leanda DeLille. And I am so excited to get to this. Yes, this also counts for the big book because it's a big book. And then the other one that I want to read is Withering Heights by um, Emily Bronte. And the final book is going to be Heartstopper. And I don't know who wrote it, but my camera is flashing. So we're going to just get through this really fast. So that's going to be my April TBR. Uh, thank you so much for watching. Thank you for joining me. And remember, I post videos every Monday, Friday, and... No, every Monday, <laughs> Wednesday, and Friday. And sometimes if I'm feeling a little extra saucy, I'll post something on Tuesdays and Thursdays. But never Saturday and Sunday, because I have to rest. Okay? Mm -hmm. So thank you so much for watching, and we'll see you next time. And please, let me know if you enjoyed seeing Rodrigo in the video. He's a lot of fun. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Bye, guys. <laughs>